Guys, I'm Mr. Allen C, and this, this is Monopoly Scooby-Doo 50th Anniversary. Let's pop this puppy open. It's sealed. I'm going to get it open for us. All right, I peeled the wrapper off. Let's see what's in here. It's very cleanly put together. I see a big stack of Scooby cash, right? Oh, man, that's cool. They got their own design on the dollars. And I see a beautiful board, Monopoly board here. Let me get this open. Wow, this is gorgeous. If you are a Scooby-Doo fan, this Monopoly game, they didn't spare the ex any expense. Look at this. It's fire. Look at each tile. Everyone Scooby-Doo themed. How cool is this? And it just goes and goes and goes. Gotta love that. This is awesome. So zoinks, zoinks. Let's take a look at some of these cards. Rut row, discover gold on the ghost red beard's property. Collect two hundred. Carlotta the gypsy's covered wagon, mortgaged for thirty dollars. These cards look great. What I want to do is I want to unbox this cash and see what it looks like. And look at this. Oh, they gave you metal Scooby-Doo figures. We got to check this out. Oh my gosh, these are too cool. Super high quality. Like I said, they didn't spare any expense on this. Check it out. We got the mystery machine. All the characters. A lot of characters. Is Shaggy there? Where's Shaggy? What the? I see Scoob. I see the mystery machine. Oh man, that's weird. I don't see Shaggy though. That is so surprising. Very heavy duty. Oh, I'm so sorry. There's Shaggy. <laughs> I was freaking out. I was like, where's the main guy? Shaggy and Scoob need to be by each other. They're going to be causing trouble. And then we got the mystery machine right here. I got to show you one other thing. You know Scrappy-Doo? Well, I have a dog named Scrappy-Doo. I'll show you. Scrappy, I love you. You're a good boy, Scrappy-Doo. I love you. All right, so sorry. Just had to show you Scrappy-Doo there. Back to this awesome monopoly game and i gotta play this with my wife all right so let's go ahead and take a look at some of that monopoly money all right guys i really took my time separated all this monopoly money take a look man you can kind of see how they value their characters in game too based on the uh amount it's worth so pirates not worth too much like look goes up i think they're playing favorites with their characters right now and then of course shaggy it's the $100 bill. And Scooby-Doo is the $500 bill. Awesome. Let's bust these cards open and take a look. You guys deserve to see it all. They really spared no expense on this game. I mean, look at just the packaging. I've never had a Monopoly where it stores the individual bills perfectly for next time you play so they're not all messed up. That is awesome. I'm appreciating this nice packaging. Now we're going to take a look at these cards that I freed from the wrapper. Wow, this is just such a premium game. I keep finding surprises. So there's Zoinks cards when you land on Zoinks spaces. There's Rut Row cards for when you land on Rut Row spaces. So there are two different ones. Let's say you get a Zoinks card. Let's see what it says. Given clearance for Monster Party, advance to the Creeper's Bell Tower. Let's do another one, for example. Take a ride the Mystery Machine. Advance to Mystery Machine. If you pass, go collect 200. These are awesome. Good driving record reduces insurance rates. Collect $150. Overheated and need to cool down. Advance to Ghost of Redbeard's Lagoon. If you pass go, collect 200 So Zoink seems to be moving you around the board quickly. Advance to Lantern or Gas Station, whichever is nearest. If unowned, you may buy it from the bank. If owned, throw dice and pay owner a total of 10 times the amount thrown. Okay, that one's bad. So this is so fun. They're really mixing it up here with Scooby-Doo Zoinks cards. Let's see what the Ruh-Roh says. That sounds like, uh-oh, like maybe some trouble. Tiptoe past a monster. Get out of jail free. This card may be kept until needed or traded. Step on Velma's glasses. <laughs> Collect 100? Why are we stepping on Velma's glasses? That's so mean. Voted Grooviest Dresser. Collect 100. These are fun, guys. 
Discover oil on zombies property. Collect 100. How cool is this Scooby-Doo game, guys? Scooby-Doo Monopoly. Yeah. As you know, in Monopoly, you can buy properties and gain money. So here's just a quick look without me explaining the cards. Some things you can purchase or make money off of. This is just a quick example. There's a ton of them. Well, guys, if you ask me, this is downright the coolest Monopoly game or Scooby-Doo I've ever seen. I am loving it. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I tried to be insightful and show you all I could. Have a great day.